What's up, Raf Gang? Welcome back to another unboxing video. I bought the Hypersense Kyra Pro for the PS5. Um, I was looking for a wireless headset for my PS2 VR, PSVR 2 uh, that comes out uh, February 22nd. So I wanted to have something that was wireless that was able to use the 3D uh, audio, the, the, the Hypersense audio that PS5 uses. And... Um, it's got rumble. So when I'm doing VR, I'm gonna have rumble in the headset and I'm gonna have rumble in my, my headphones. So I'm looking forward to that. Hopefully that's gonna be a fantastic immersion experience. Uh, so yeah, this one has Bluetooth as well. So you can do Bluetooth with the um, the 3.0 3 wireless uh, dongle. So you can able to listen to someone calls you while you're playing the game. Uh, it's got great audio. It's got 50 millimeter drivers, which is very important for me. It's got the LED uh, lights on the side that works with uh, Razer Chroma for your PC. Uh, it's got low latency Bluetooth, fast charging, long lasting battery life. And it looks fantastic with the white and black accent, just like the PS5 and the BS VR2 headset is going to be. So I'm going to unbox this for you. I'm going to hook it up to the PS5 and make sure it works uh, really well. So uh, without further ado, guys, let's get this unboxed. Let's get it. All right, guys, so here's the front of the box. Kyra Pro dual wireless headset with haptics. And it works for PS5, PS4, and PC, and mobile. There's the side there. Hypersense. You get uh, USB 3 cable. Uh, the microphone is removable, which is nice. And the uh, wireless dongle USB-C. And uh, yeah, let's get this uh, unboxed here. We'll have the sticker. Oh my, here they are. Flush material in, inside, very nice. Ooh, headsets are nice and light, very good. All right, let's pull this out here. Then we're gonna have the uh, Kyra Pro from Razer and instruction manual and how to get it all set up and all that great stuff. Wherever you play, some kind of code or something, I'm not sure what. The Razor Gold voucher. All right, so we got this whole thing to come out here. Okay. It's this big thing of foam. Okay, I guess you're supposed to dig in and pull it all out here. Oh, jeez. There's a dongle stuck in the middle here. Okay. So you have a removable boom mic with the uh, wind windscreen filter. That's really cool. Okay. Like that. This is going to be a USB to a USB-C adapter. Not sure what that's all about. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Oh, all right. So this is the, uh, the 3.0 wireless transmitter from Razer. And I guess you can plug it into here and then plug this into a port on your PS4 or five or your PC. If you want, that is awesome. And then looks like this is probably going to be your charging cable, USB-C, USB. All right, charging cable. All right, very nice. Now, for the headset itself. Yep, you can turn them in. Very nice. Soft, cushy. Nice fabric here. Oh, you got some padding on the inside here. Very nice. Very twistable. Very nice. Here is your 2.4. And Bluetooth, this is your volume wheel here. And this one here is not sure what this is. Could be the Hypersense. On the other side is going to be your headphone or yeah, microphone connection here that goes in the front. Click. This is going to be the USB-C charging. This is going to be your power button here. 
Uh, this is going to be our chat balance, looks like. Looks like your mic, your mic volume here. Microphone volume. And then your mic mute button, where it's red here. Nice. The top, you have some nice material here on top. As far as twisting goes, it's pretty twisty. And we do have the numbers, this metal frame number here, which is nice here on both sides. It's like it's one through nine. And then razor on the top. All right, let's go ahead and flip the camera and put them on. All right, guys, here they are. They look pretty good. Gonna have the LEDs, razor symbols on the side here. I'm gonna plug them in. They gotta loosen up big time here. This is pretty stiff here. All right, here we go, guys. First time. Okay, my ears fit inside the cup, which is good. Move the microphone. Medium clamping force. Nice. It's a very good seal around my ears because you know when you when your ears are sealed and you talk, it feels you know it sounds muffled. Like it's noise canceling almost. But it's very nice. This is these are very comfortable. Doesn't have the cooling gel, no cooling gel. But they're very comfortable. A very nice, comfortable balance. The top of my head and the clamp force of my ears. It's really nice. Really nice. Uh okay. <clears throat> Great. This is very nice. These are very cozy, guys. All right, I'm going to get them hooked up uh, to my PS5, and then uh, we'll go ahead and play something and uh, give you my impressions of the haptic feedback. All right, be right back. All right, Raf Gang. So I am talking to you with the included microphone uh, now. It might not sound the greatest, but this is what you're going to get. After my short time with this headset, I got to say it is absolutely awesome. I'm very pleased. This headset, comfort, weight, Sound, haptic, is definitely better than the Nobby Ultimate. The original giant cans, much better than those. Um, I feel I feel great with these headphones. So this will be my de facto headphones for my PSVR 2 when it comes out. I'll have the wireless, I'll have the cool design. Microphone is there, battery life is there, and the haptic feedback is going to be great. Uh, I don't know the length of time that these will work so i didn't really charge them all the way uh, but the uh, the haptic is great you're gonna have three stages of haptic light medium heavy and off you just keep pressing the haptic button uh volume rocker is here up and down uh mic monitoring is going to be on this side uh there's an app you can download um on your phone and i believe it's called uh razor kyra pro something or other Razer Audio. So you see Razer Audio. Razer Audio, uh, basically what you have to do is take it off of the USB mode and switch it to Bluetooth mode, and then it will find it. And then from the app, you can actually um, adjust the LED lights. You can do pulsing, you can do static, uh, cycle wave, uh, or audio. So whatever audio you're listening to, it'll flash the lights. That's what I shows. Uh, other than that, uh, you get EQ mode. If there's like four or five different EQ settings, just by pressing the, the button here. Uh, other than that, uh, pretty good. Uh, I like the LED lights, nice and bright. And the swivel cups, flexible, and uh, very good sound quality. Bass is tight. Treble is, is clear, not sharp, clear. And that's just default. I haven't really messed with the EQ settings at all. You can if you want on this headset. Other than that, uh, I'm pretty pretty good. I am pretty good to keep these. They come with a two-year warranty, which is great. Uh, I was not able to get the uh, the Razer Synapse on my PC to recognize these headphones for some reason, so I don't know what's up with that. I guess it's the app exclusive. And then on my PS5, hooked up to PS5, recognized it. Uh, sound was great. 
volume up and down mic monitoring you can check that so it works fine in the ps5 so that was, that was fine uh, other than that uh yeah that is going to be it for the kyra pro from razor ps5 edition check it out guys i'll leave a link in the description below if you want to pick yourself up one of these helps me out helps you out appreciate it and uh yeah these are pretty cool i got my headset for the vr can't wait all right guys thanks for watching like subscribe share and see the next one home theater rooms wrap up see you guys